Drivers are always paid based on the actual mileage and time of a ride, but lately Uber and Lyft have been tweaking this info. So where do we find these rates? I'm Joe here with the Rideshare Guy, and today we're gonna show you where to find your personal per mile and per minute rates. So first off, driver rates are based on two main factors. One is when you signed up to drive, and the other is what city you drive in. So personally, I've, I signed up to drive back in 2014. So I'm actually grandfathered into higher rates than newer drivers. Um, back when I signed up, it was a commission-based system. It was a commission-based system for a couple of years. But when I signed up, it was an 80% commission. Um, but for drivers that signed up uh, December 2015 or later, it changed from 80% to 75%. So Lyft and Uber started taking a little bit more. But now it's no longer commission-based it's based strictly on per mile per minute rates. And Lyft and Uber have been tweaking those rates um, in the past couple of years. So they'll go up, they'll go down, they'll change the per mile, the per mile rate, they'll change the per minute rate, they'll raise and lower. It's, it's been pretty confusing, um, but we, there is a spot where you can find exactly where those rates are located. First, we'll take a look at Uber. I'm on an iPhone here and I'm just using my mobile Safari browser. You'll wanna go to your Uber driver dashboard, which is located at partners.uber.com. And once you're logged in, you'll select that top left clipboard icon, and then you'll select fares. You can just select okay for this message. So we'll just scroll down here on the bottom right you can see that I'm located in Minneapolis and St. Paul. And if you scroll down a little bit further, you can see that my per mile rate is 68 cents per mile and my per minute rate is 20.8 cents. Now, in order to see your lift rates, you'll wanna to go to your Lyft driver dashboard and that's located at lyft.com slash drive slash dashboard. All right, once you're logged in here, you'll just select that top left clipboard icon and you'll select rate card. Scroll down. And you can see my Lyft rates are the exact same as my UberX rates, 68 cents per mile and 20.8 cents per minute. So that's how you find your rates. Now again, you're gonna to wanna to remember that it's no longer a commission-based system. It's a per mile per minute rate that you're paid for every ride. So every ride that you give, you're paid for the actual, the actual mileage and time that you traveled. So if you take a different route or a different route than the suggested route, you're paid for the actual time and distance that you traveled. Um, if your rider adds a stop or if your rider takes, you know, if your ride takes more time, you're in traffic, you're getting paid a per mile per minute rate. Driver rates may be different for every driver. And also remember the main two factors in determining how your rates were determined are when you signed up to drive and what city you drive in. Again, myself, I've been grandfathered into slightly higher rates in my market because I signed up to drive back in 2014. And also my rates here in Minneapolis and St. Paul are gonna differ from other markets because each market has their own pricing. So drivers will have higher rates in San Francisco and New York than say Minneapolis and St. Paul, and they may, may be lower in smaller markets um, than Minneapolis and St. Paul. And if you do actually wanna compare rates uh, to other cities, a great website to utilize is uberestimate.com. This will give you what passengers pay in those cities, but you can kind of determine what drivers are getting paid by taking a 75% or 80% of what the per mile and per minute rates are in that market. So for instance, uh, here we can scroll down and see the rates in Minneapolis select Minneapolis. Here's the black black SUV. We'll scroll down. We'll see the Uber X rates. Now here in Minneapolis and St. Paul, passengers pay 26 cents per minute and 85 cents per mile. If we do some math, so we'll take 0.85, multiply that by 0.8, that's 68 cents per mile. And that 68 cents per mile is what my personal rate is. So it's 80% of the per mile rate here in Minneapolis and St. Paul. And we can also take the 26 cents per minute multiply that by 0.8, and there I get my 20.8. So again, my personal rates are 80% of the per minute and per mile rates in my city here in Minneapolis and St. Paul. And we can take another look at an example of say San Francisco. The UberX rates in San Francisco are 39 cents per minute and 91 cents per mile. So that per minute rate is quite a bit higher and that per mile rate is just a bit higher than Minneapolis and St. Paul. So what are your personal rates? Uh, what city do you drive in and how long have you been a driver? Um, if you haven't subscribed to the Rideshare Guy channel, please subscribe. We post new videos every single week. Thanks again for watching and drive safe. Thanks.